Hi, in this video we're going to be using terms for actions and directions that you will be using throughout your massage career. The first thing I want you to know is superior and inferior. Superior is the direction towards the top of your head. Inferior is the direction towards your feet. Superior head, inferior feet. If you imagine a drawing a line down the center of your body, the going towards that line will be, will be medial. Going away from that line, everything away from that line is lateral. Okay? Medial towards the center of your body, lateral away from the center of the body. Okay? Closer to the surface of your skin is superficial. Going farther in is deep. Okay? As far as the limbs go, both the legs and the arms, distal is farther away from the torso, proximal is closer to. So my elbow is proximal to my wrist. My fingers are distal to my elbow, as an example. So distal farther away, proximal closer. You want to be repeating these over and over. Once again, the more familiar you get with this, the more easy it is and you can just do it without thinking. Anterior is the front of your body, posterior is your back. So you have the front of your body, this is the anterior part, the back side, everything on the back side is posterior. Okay? All right. As far as actions go, we have extension and flexion. All right? This is flexion. This is extension. All right? Every part of your body. All right? Flexion, extension. Flexion, extension. Okay? All right? Abduction and adduction. Abduction is moving your arms or legs away from your body. Adduction is towards your body. It, so it's spelled AB. Abduction. Abduction is away, like an alien abduction. Adduction is bringing towards. Adduction, you're adding to. Adduction. Okay? When your palm is up, your arm is supine. Same thing when you're laying on the table or uh, moving towards. This is supination. The opposite, face down, is pronation. So when you, supi when you supinate, you're bringing, it's the action of bringing face up. Pronation is the action of bringing face down. Supine, prone. Okay? As far as the feet goes, with the toes facing up, you have dorsiflexion. If you plant your feet or your toes towards the ground, you have pr uh, plantar flexion. Plantar flexion, toes pointing down, dorsiflexion, toes pointing up. When you bring the inside of your foot up, so your big toe is coming up and your little toe is on the floor, that is inversion. And the opposite of that, little toe coming up, big toe planted, eversion. Inversion, big toe up, eversion, little toe up. The coloring book is another resource that you're going to use to learn the anatomy for circulatory massage. Here are the specific pages that you need to go over for this section. On page two, you have the terms of position and direction. On page 21, terms of movement. 
and page 67, a functional overview of the entire body.